Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a computer mockup using my favorite graphic design tool, Canva. Now, using a computer mockup is a great way to showcase your products or services, whether you have your online business, maybe you have a course that you want to sell, or your own Etsy shop. Now, you could use these computer mockups on your blog for social media posts. I have done a few of them or landing pages where you want to drive traffic to. So make sure that you watch all the way to the end so you can learn how to do them as well. Now, if this is your first time visiting my YouTube channel, consider subscribing today. I do upload weekly videos to help you build an impactful online business. So let's go ahead and head over to my computer to get started. So here we are on Canva, and all you have to do next is, the, is decide what type of design you want to create. Do you want to do an Instagram post? Do you want to do a Pinterest pin? Do you want to promote your products and services um, on a Facebook post? It really depends on what you're going to do. So I'm going to go ahead and select Instagram for this tutorial. Now the next thing you need to do is take a screenshot of your product and services. If you have an Etsy shop, you could take a screenshot of your homepage. If you have a small business, you could take a screenshot of your website. And if you have like products and services like a course, then you could take a picture of that to use for your um, mock-up. Now, once you have the screenshot, you're going to upload it right here. You're going to click on upload and you're going to upload it to Canva. This is a screenshot that I did on my actual Etsy store. And that's what I'm promoting on this video. So the next step is going to elements and from here you're going to go down to frames you're going to see all click there and these are all the different different types of frames available they have a tablet mock-up they have a phone they have a desktop in a in a regular computer so you could choose any of these i'm going to do the desktop one for this tutorial you could drag the corners to make it bigger and you, if you hold down and move it around your canva you're able to go ahead and center the picture if you need it to. So I'm gonna put it right there. And from here, you're gonna go ahead and go to uploads and you're gonna drag your image on top of the computer. You see how simple that was? This is how you create a computer mockup of your products and services. Now, if you're using this photo for your landing page, then you really don't have to do anything else. What I would suggest is downloading this with a clear, transparent background you will need to have work for canva in order to use that feature but download it and then you could add it to your landing page where you already have text if you're using this for your let's say your instagram post to promote your etsy store or to promote your small business then what i do recommend is adding additional elements to the picture maybe adding text maybe adding like an arrow pointing to the store just to make it more exciting and engaging so people can engage with your actual post. So I'm going to put shop now as a text. I'm going to put that up here. And then you could put, um, you could go to elements and you could type in arrow if you want. And I'm going to go ahead and pick this one here. Put it down here. Make this black so it could look, so people could see it. And then you could add other elements as well. Um, you could type in the word shop and see what comes up. And as you can see, they have so many different options. So you could do something like this just to make it fun and add it to the picture and put it right here. Um, keep in mind, you could change the colors to your branding colors, um, which is really nice as you could see. But this is how simple it is to create a mock-up for your products and services that you could promote, not only on your blog, but social media posts or landing pages. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment below. Thank you guys for watching.